but these are just general products and the cost is incremental because I need 11 in any way. So I might get that 3 band rather than 2 band. So that's why 11 AD is happening. So what is 11 AD? So 11 AD instead of basic service set which we used to have before BSS, now we have personal basic service set EBSS. And these are group of stations that want to communicate. So in one room you might have many PBSSs because you may want to communicate with your TV and somebody else may want to communicate with their TV or with their whatever devices. So you could have PBSS. And each PBSS has a central point like access point but it is called P PCP. And PCP provides the scheduling and timing using beacons. So basically this is the one which does the access point job is selling. Okay, now it is just, this is the start of the cycle and who gets what when, when they can transmit. So each frame, so this is a beacon and this is another beacon. So in between is beacon interval. So this is called super frame. The super frame consists of beacon time. This is where the beacon is actually is not just instantaneous beacon happens for quite some time. So it tells you some other information about the network. Then associative beam farming time. This is the time where you find out who is where in what direction. If I want to talk to her, I have to do some adjustments and I have to talk to her. I have to adjustments and so on and so forth on this side to him. So all that is happening in the associative beam farming time. Then announcement time. These, these are common announcements which most like multicast and then data transfer. So beacon time associating big farming time ABFT, announcement time and data transfer time DTT, data transfer time and more details are coming up about each of these. So only PCP can send a beacon during the beacon time. So you cannot have multiple beacons otherwise it will be confusing. You can have multiple networks in the same area and they will have their own beacons but one PCP. In a in the associative beam farming time, PCP performs antenna training with its member. So if I am the PCP, you guys are the members, I will uh, talk to one by one to each of you, figure out where exactly you are located. Everything is directional here, right? Everything is very directional. So I cannot be facing this way and talk to him, right? So basically, I will have to tune my antenna position figure out how to talk to station 1, talk to station 2, talk to station 3. That is what AF, ABFT time is. In AT announcement time, PCP polls members and receives non-data responses. So the next time, that announcement time, I can ask, do you have something to say? You say, I want to send something to B, you know, to that station. So will, and I need 5 milliseconds. So I will poll every one of you and figure out what is your requirement? In AT PCP polls, okay. In DTT, all stations exchange data frame in a dedicated service period or by contention in a contention based service period. So, you might have just like we had real time and non real time application in P 82.11 earlier part where they had, we had um, what we call point coordination function PCF and distributed coordination function. PCF has a dedicated time, nobody else can transmit during that time and that is reserved for you and the distributed coordination function is the time when you know you have to do RTS, CTS, etc. Here we don't have RTS, CTS but we have this thing which is called contention period. So we have two periods, dedicated period and contention period and during DTT stations either use distributed coordination function or hybrid coordination function. So distributed coordination function is the original 11 thing and hybrid coordination function is the 11E with priority of service and all that, right? So HCF and DCF, we have discussed this before. So back to this slide, you have this one, this is the contention period and this is the dedicated period. So if you get a dedicated allotment, the PCP will tell you that your time starts at this time and end at that time, right? In the announcement time, it will all be told. 
and then when the time starts you know exactly when you can speak and for how long right the question is is this time divided or this is determined by by just chance yeah. right that's the question so the first part is clearly divided first part is in the sp part dedicated part is well defined right the contention part the contention part the details are coming up little bit later okay but there is it, it cannot be a fixed interval though I and mean, basically it has to be you know everybody has a different length so how that happens is is somewhat parallel thing you know for example you can talk to him while she can talk to me i mean like basically here things are directional so there are a lot of parallel transmission okay so that's the idea is that pcp is not a device that you can buy or you would buy one of the stations which is most powerful will become the pcp so for example in if you have a computer and several other things the computer will become pcp if you have a television and everything else then television will become the pcp so the idea is that you don't have to buy a separate device okay um, but it is a separate function so uh, another thing that you should know is the function versus packaging pcp is a separate function so you could define a box which just does that, that function and nothing else which is possible but how do you justify in the real world that one right so so that's why generally pcp is built into the devices in the previous case here this computer would be pcp or the docking station could be pcp or you know somebody who is central to everything and both of them are piece, have the capability but one of them will decide that okay i'm not going to be pcp in this network you be the pcp so the so the one that has pcp on it, it still follows all of the rules that the pcp dictates right so so the thing is if suppose it is a pcp and of course it is a station as well so it will have to basically decide all of those things so it will say okay i need you know two seconds to transfer to this person at this station and when should i be allocated and that will be allocated yeah so a pcp a, a station could have both functions which most likely it is a station as well as a pcp all right so the beacon now the problem with the beacon is where should i transmit if i transmit in this direction this person will not get the beacon right so i have to say the beacon many many times so you see there is a this color beacon this color is not representing here um, the wavelength it is representing the direction so because stations are in all directions and they will not be able to hear if i am facing the wrong direction therefore the beacon has to be done many times although they are omnidirectional one beacon is transmitted through every antenna configuration okay the antenna uh, antenna configuration is coming up in a minute yeah so yeah right because the thing is at this time we don't know exactly where you are right so i mean i cannot beam form at this time right so i'm going to just send it in all direction here but then i'm going to move and say in all directions here and so that is coming up right it is not very narrowly focused at this point 